We're here at the Autosport International Show uh, with uh, Freddie Terza from VP Racing Fuels. Um, so, Freddie, can you start by telling us about your 2014 range? Sure. And we've got a lot of new, pro exciting products for 2014. First of all, what I'd like to talk to you about is our N6 fuel, which is FIA certified fuel for the rally, rally racing, rally cross type of application. As everyone's aware of, the, the rules have changed for 2014 and I think we're excited about N6 because we feel that it's going to be a very, very good fuel for that type of application. The second two fuels I want to talk about is our new Unleaded Extreme. It carries 110 motor octane value, which is almost unheard of for a non-oxygenated unleaded product. The third fuel we have is our C20 which is another non-oxygenated fuel that makes a tremendous amount of power and has a variety of applications that we can utilize and put it into. So for the unleaded fuel you mentioned there, what allows you to get that sort of octane number? That would be priority information, Chris, that I prefer not to share with you or the general public. But uh, we, we worked really hard at this. Our, our lab has done a lot of experimentation and we've done a lot of testing with this fuel yep. and it has really really shined here in the last few months. Yeah. Okay, that sounds good. And what about the rest of the range? What have you, have you got? Yeah. We've got something else that a lot of people have heard of our Q16 which has been very very powerful fuel the last several years and we've had to come out with a fuel that was better and we're calling that C45. So a lot of drag racing applications, mm -hmm. a lot of guys that are looking for ultimate power and fuel are C45 in a non aspirated application will work extremely well. And obviously racers are always always looking for power. Yes. Um, are you seeing any, any other trends, you know, people going towards particular properties for the fuel? I, I don't know. You know, things have changed here quite quite drastically uh, as far as the type of oxygenates that are being used. And like like I mentioned, the, these unleaded fuels that we were talking about, our C20 and our unleaded extreme, are not oxygenated. What does that mean? That means it doesn't have an ethanol or have any other type of components in the fuel to oxygenate it. Yeah. Okay. That sounds good. And um, is there anything to watch out for? You know, going ahead for the future. Well, I think right now we're calling 2014 the future. Uh, it, it's going to be an exciting year for us as a company, and I think it's going to be exciting for the entire motorsports industry to show what we have to offer them. Yeah. And of course, uh, this year you guys just signed a, a, a deal with the United Sports Car Championship, I believe. Yes, and we're very excited about that. We're looking forward to being at the Rolex 24-hour race in Daytona here in a few weeks. Uh, it's going to be exciting. We're all excited and hopefully the racers will be excited when they, once they see and are, are fully aware of how the fuels will function for them. Okay. Freddie, thank you very much. Chris, thank you very much. Thanks for having me.